subscribers. We're very close. So if you want to be involved in the giveaway and you don't want to miss those details, make sure that you do hit that subscribe button because you'll need to be able to check out the channel um, and see it when it comes through. Let's have a look. What's happening for Pisces this week? Love messages for Pisces. What's Pisces current? Oh, the cards have been crazy. Pisces current love situation. What's happening here? Pisces love situation. There we go. That's a bit better. Oh, they still want to come out. What is so urgent here? Ah, oh, you're waiting for something to be revealed here, Pisces. You could be dealing with a cancer. Maybe something about the future. Some plans. Three more. Sorry, four more. Love situation for Pisces. Oh, two more coming out. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're waiting for some clarity, some truth. Look at this. With the Seven of Cups in reverse, clarified immediately with the Ace of Swords. Three more. <clears throat> mm. Okay, Page of Cups flicked out in reverse. Two more. Seven of Wands. I'm going to come back and clarify that page of cups because you're standing your ground over something, um, not budging, someone maybe being stubborn or wanting to fight. Yeah, this situation is something that is not over for the two of you. Tell me about the page of cups, please. Clarify the page of cups with two. Mm, look at this. Eight of Cups in, rever uh, in the upright. So you're really disconnecting from someone. It's almost like you're, wait you're waiting, possibly a Leo. You're waiting for someone. You're waiting for truth and clarity about a situation. Almost as if you can confirm a rejection. This is very strange, Pisces. It's, it's like you want to be right about something. You want to be right about someone offering their cup somewhere else. Um, so that it's almost like you're looking for closure, actually. Give me something for that seven of wands, please. So you're definitely waiting for something. Yes, yeah, so you can move away. It's like you're waiting for confirmation so you can move on from something. Tell me about the world card in reverse. This Maybe this world card is in reverse because you can't move on until you get this confirmation. Yeah, you're waiting. Look at this. You're waiting for to work out what your next move is with the not your next move, but what your path is, what direction you want to go. Um, I really sense that a lot of you. Uh, yeah, it's not. It's not. It's. You feel like you've missed an opportunity, or you know that this opportunity is missed, but you're waiting for confirmation of something. Tell me what this three of wands is, please. Yeah, someone's been sneaky or um, lying, cheating, stealing, and maybe you're waiting just for the truth to come out, waiting for confirmation that you were right. Give me two for that Ace of Swords, please. Mm. It's definitely something that you don't want to invest in anymore, but you're looking, this is very <laughs> convoluted. Yeah, again, two of cups in reverse and the seven of pentacles in reverse. This is something where you know the connection is done, but you're looking for that closure. You're looking for that final, yep, see, I knew it. I knew it. I knew I was right about this person. I knew that there wasn't enough love here. I knew that they were going to offer their cup somewhere else. I knew, I knew, I knew. And it's like you can't kind of move on from this until you get that confirmation. Give me two for how Pisces is feeling, please. How does Pisces feel about this situation? King of Wands in reverse. You may feel like this person hasn't kept their word or that they've lied to you. Um, again, with that Seven of Swords in reverse, you're waiting to, again, Strength card in reverse, possible Leo again. It's making you really unhappy though. It's a situation that makes you really unhappy. But you can't disconnect from it. Give me three for how the other person is feeling. How does this other person that Pisces is here for feeling? Knight of Cups. Yeah, see, they're moving forward with a love offer. 
um, possibly towards someone else. And maybe that is the confirmation that you're going to get. Yeah, see the seven of swords coming out in reverse again. So you're going to, you're going to get confirmation over whatever you think is happening. Um, but it's actually what you need to move on. Look at this, a five of swords betrayal, seven of swords in reverse. So whatever, and then the ace of, ace of wands in reverse. This It's almost like you're a bit bored of this whole situation. You're a bit sick of it. The emperor, this person may have been quite controlling, king of cups, emotionally unavailable. So you're waiting for confirmation that you were right. That's what I'm getting here. But it, you're only waiting for it so that it allows you to move on, if that makes sense. What's the overall outcome here, please? Most likely outcome for Pisces this week, this situation. Most likely outcome for Pisces this week in this situation. Four of Wands in reverse. So definitely... Um, yeah, it's, this is actually going to bring you some relief. If you've had some sleepless nights, worrying about what the truth is, um, you really seem to be hyper-focused on exactly what is going on with this other person. Yeah. You may be discovering that they're in a relationship and you kind of suspected. Um, you may, it may be something to do with their work or your work. But this is what's going to allow you, yeah, this is what's going to allow you to work on yourself and let go of this connection, two of cups in reverse, look, ten of cups in reverse as well. It's a very complex, complex reading here. If you need a personal reading, you can find all of those details down below, remember, um, and we can go into your specific energies. Now, maybe this is in reverse as well because it is a general. So let's get some advice, please. Advice for Pisces, three cards. It's kind of a bit of a quick reading, Pisces, because it's been pretty clear. Look at the repeating energies coming out here. The seven of pentacles again, two more. Six of Pentacles and the Tower. I think when you look at this, when this, when you discover this or you hear about this, and again with the Four of Cups in reverse, uh, sorry, in the upright, when you discover this, it's actually you're going to realize that you dodged a bullet here. Um, and that you gave everything you could. And it wouldn't have mattered. It wouldn't have changed the outcome here. Um, give me something for Romance Angel, please, for Pisces. Romance Angel for Pisces. True love. Romance of a lifetime. So you may have felt like you had true love with this person. Um... I think that this is going to allow you to move on and find your own true love though because you're stuck at the moment with this two of cups in reverse. There's a lot of stuck energy. You're waiting for this to be revealed, whatever this is. It's like you're waiting for confirmation so that you can release this situation. Um, and I think this week it will be coming to you, Pisces. So do make sure that you hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and um, do leave me comments in the comment section below. I'm so grateful for all of the comments and support that I receive through the channel. So thank you very much. I do read all those comments and I respond to as many as I can. Um, otherwise, Pisces, I think you're going to, this is going to be a bit of a turning point for you this week. So, um, which is a good thing. It's a good thing. Have a great week, Pisces. Bye.